It's, uh, it's been amazing to watch this grow over the years. Al Cresta gives a studio tour at Ave Maria Radio in Ann Arbor. In the tour group on this day, a very special guest, Bishop Joseph Sistone. He's joined by faithful from across the diocese who are ready to record a rosary for a future full of hope. I believe that we're all set. The rosary allows us to contemplate the great mysteries of Christ through the eyes of Mary, the Virgin Mother. Bishop Sistone begins by recording reflections for the glorious, the joyful, the sorrowful, and the luminous mysteries of the rosary. Holy Mary, Mother of God. For most, the experience at Ave Maria Radio is their first inside of a recording studio. Amen. Excellent. Okay, we can move on. Faithful of all ages found they had to repeat the prayer several times to get the professional audio needed for broadcast. It wasn't exactly what Matthew Davis had expected. I expected it to be like on TV. Like you were just like kneeling down and saying that. Once all the audio is collected, production staff goes to work selecting music and placing all the recordings on a single track. Very soon, faithful from across the diocese will have an opportunity to pray the rosary together. Prayer is a connection with God. I like how some of the teenagers are involved in this project in junior high um, because I think anytime you can get that group together, it uh, inspires them later. To, um, they'll remember that moment and they'll remember that they do have a place in the church. Buenos dias, Bishop. Buenos dias. Reaching out to the Spanish speaking members of the Catholic Church, Bishop Sistone also recorded a rosary for a future full of hope in Spanish. Soy el obispo Joseph Sistone de la diócesis de Saginaw, Michigan. The rosary in Spanish, you know, is, is a beautiful idea, a very great idea to, to have it in Spanish for everybody who wants to. Especially for the for the two for the older older people that are that are Hispanics people that are that are that's how they speak like my father that's how he speaks uh, Spanish. Gloria al Padre y al Hijo y al Espíritu Santo como era en el principio ahora y siempre por los siglos de los siglos Amen. It would help actually my kids because I was raised praying the Rosary I'm familiar with it and I do it every day I try to but my kids I know. I think they're going to learn a lot from it. Beginning in October, Ave Maria Radio will air the rosary twice daily, broadcasting locally on WMAX 1440 AM. The rosary will air Monday through Friday at 5.30 and 10.30 AM, Saturday at 5.30 and 8.30 AM, and on Sundays at 5.30 and 9.30 AM. I think the face of American Catholicism is going to be very different within a generation uh, because of Catholic Radio being present People, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, people can find out what the church actually teaches. Copies of both the English and Spanish versions of a rosary for a future full of hope will be made available to parishes in the near future. Michelle Davis plans to share it with her family on their 20-minute drive to church. She says prayer is central in her life. I would not make it without it. It's very important and it's a tradition I tried to pass on to my kids. Um, as a matter of fact, my six-year-old, whenever he hears a siren, he says a Hail Mary now, and he reminds me too. So I think anything we can do to promote prayer and show how important it is will help our, our church grow.